Crypto Lightsaber back with another video guys. We're going to talk about Squid Game 2.0 um, I believe we're going to see a lot of this type of stuff coming out now um, meme coins in particular um, People are bored right the the bear market is on and Bitcoin's going down. It's dragging the market down people are bored. They want something fun They want they want to they want somewhere to put their money in the last bear market, we made a lot of money on meme coins, and uh, I believe those times are coming again soon. There's a season for everything, right? Um, the chart doesn't lie, okay? So when you look at the chart for this token, it launched a couple of days ago on the 14th of June, and since then, it's done nothing but up and to the right pumpage. Um, if we do a measured move, I believe it's like over like 5,000%, you know, something crazy, right? Even from this support level right here, we're looking at about 700%. Uh, 750% move so it would have been nice to be in down here and of course you you, you want to be buying pullbacks right don't get wrecked but um you know this could be a potential moonshot it's still under a million in market cap at 649k with 39k in liquidity so you know this is a very volatile asset Okay, if you don't know what you're doing, you, you've got a very low risk tolerance, don't buy this token, okay? But if you are a DGEN like myself, this could be a potential moonshot for you. Now, this is an NFT game, okay? Like I said, focus on the Squid Games. They basically want to, you know, make Squid Game viral again. That's their whole, you know, if you read that, okay? Um, it talks about the season two of Squid Game has been officially confirmed. So they're basically just capitalizing on that, okay? Um, so this is available on Pancake Swap. You can also buy it on Rubik, uh, through Rubik, sorry, directly on their website right here. If you just connect your wallet, but of course, yeah, you can just go over to Pancake Swap and buy this token, and you'll be in with a bag. Or you could just do it on PooCoin, guys. But um, in terms of the game, now the game doesn't seem to be live yet, okay? Uh, but it's basically going to be an NFT game. I'm not sure how it's gonna, you know, how it's gonna how it's gonna work. Or whether they're just selling NFTs, okay? I'm assuming it's going to be a game, okay? But in terms of roadmaps, when it comes to these things, right? I don't pay much attention to roadmaps. You know, they're talking about a squid game swap. And um, obviously, coin market cap and coin gecko listing would obviously make this thing pump. If you remember, there was a squid game token at Rugged. Obviously, this is not the same thing. It's not the same developers, of course. But, um, you know, there is a stigma attached to this type of thing. But the chart doesn't lie. Like I said, right? It's been pumping. And um, they've got a very small community, so there's lots of room for growth. If you join them on Telegram, okay, um, they're doing a video chat at the moment as we speak. But there's quite a bit of hype on this project, okay? So, you know, I thought I'd share it with you, right? Not, It's not going to be for everybody. It's not going to be everyone's cup of tea, you know. Um, don't shoot a messenger, okay? I'm just letting you know about the project, okay? Some people, they oh, stop promoting these, you know, and all that sort of stuff, you know. People try to you know, uh, coming with their negativity. But at the end of the day, anybody that got in down here is not going to be negative, okay? And if this does another huge pump, people are going to be happy with their gains that they're making in a bear market, in my opinion. So, you know, I'm open to everything when it comes to crypto. At the end of the day, uh, you could hold Luna and get wrecked. You could hold Celsius and get wrecked, okay? Uh, you could hold a mean coin and get wrecked. But then again, you can make a lot of money with it, okay? So I always talk about risk tolerance, okay? Um, you don't want to go throwing like 100 BNB into something like this. You can put like one or two BNB, you know, five BNB, something small and make a whole lot of money with these type of projects. So I always want people to understand that it's high risk. Don't risk more than what you can afford to lose. You know, we haven't heard that enough, right? Don't risk more than what you can afford to lose. Yeah, Squid Game 2.0. I'll leave all the links in the description. Do me a favor and subscribe to the channel. Tick the little bell for notifications, guys. And I'll see you in the very next video.